UT Quidditch Club, we actually go by the Time Turners, um, and we're a super like ragtag bunch of kids, and we're just out here playing this full contact sport. We are using half inch PVC pipe with the um, according rubber stoppers on the ends for our brooms. A typical goal in Muggle Quidditch is 10 points. Um, quaffle through any of the hoops, it doesn't matter what size the hoop is, whether it's the three foot, four and a half, or six foot, it's 10 points. The Seeker and the Snitch are really, they're what makes Quidditch an incredibly unique sport. Um, in the Harry Potter universe, the way that the game works is there's this little enchanted gold ball called the Golden Snitch. They developed this little golden ball that would fly around and evade capture, and the Seeker's only job during the match is to catch that little golden ball, and that's worth 150 points in the Harry Potter universe. Now, as far as Muggle Quidditch goes, obviously we cannot enchant a little golden ball to fly around and evade our Seekers, so what we did was the Snitch Runner is an athlete that's separate from both teams, and they're also so a registered ref, so they're available to ref the game as well as playing in it. And they have a little gold sock, pretty much, attached to the back of their shorts. And there's about a tennis ball sized ball in there, and the Seekers have to get that from the Snitch Runner. Um, so it's kind of like flag football. And then it's worth 30 points in Muggle Quidditch. What surprises me the most about Quidditch is also the thing that makes me the happiest. It's just the ridiculous amount of diversity that we get. Um, we've got over 20 majors represented on our team. It's also the most gender inclusive sport in the world. And so just seeing young women have the ability to play a full contact sport and non-binary people as well. It's, one of, it's the only sport that specifically accommodates non-binary people in existence. I would love for us to become a staple on this campus, just to be something that's so much a part of this campus that we couldn't imagine it without it. It makes a niche for people who don't really have another place to express themselves in an athletic manner. Can't get enough Noxine? Follow us on Facebook at facebook.com slash for news and special offers.